Apple and Amazon are on Megan's radar. The new mats will be ruined by the Dutches. Meghan Markle plans to pursue new partners soon after being rejected by Netflix. A week ago, the online giant bluntly canceled the Duchess of Sussex's animated project, Pearl. Pearl is one of three famous projects cut by Netflix due to the stock crisis. It is known that at this time, Netflix's subscriptions were seriously reduced. About 200,000 subscribers have suddenly unfollowed this online giant's channel. What's more, the company's stock price is also down 25% from last year. This is an alarming situation for media companies like Netflix. Amid the stock crunch, Netflix bosses have decided to cut a number of non-essential projects this year, including Dino Daycare, Boons and Curses, and Pearl. In addition, a source revealed that at least 10 to 15 Netflix employees have been laid off due to economic shortages. Tudum a website that publishes marketing stories for Netflix shows has also been canceled. The official information released last Thursday made many people extremely sad. On the eve of the economic crisis, Netflix turned down all interviews from the Los Angeles Times. Experts say the reduced workload will be significantly more than the information leaked to the outside. The Duchess of Sussex was unfortunately one of the partners turned down by this online guy. It's not clear if Harry and Meghan's company, Archwell Productions, will be put on the list. But Netflix's rejection of Meghan is a bad sign for the couple. After receiving information from Netflix, many sources revealed that Megan is looking for a new shore to continue developing her first animation project. She deleted all references to the Pearl project from her Archwell website. It seems that the Duchess of Sussex has accepted this rejection of her partner. She is starting to look for new broadcast giants to be able to fund this project of hers. Fortunately, in the Netflix contract, Harry and Meghan will be allowed to sell products rejected by Netflix to another party. Therefore, finding a sponsor for Pearl will not affect the value of the contract between Meghan and Netflix. A source said, Megan and Harry will not give up on taking Pearl to the screen. They are determined to not let all the work and creative endeavors put into the idea simply fall away. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are said to have a very good relationship in Hollywood circles. Harry worked with Apple to promote a series about mental health. Meghan Markle also once teamed up with Disney to release a documentary about wildlife. It seems that finding a new destination will not be too difficult for Meghan. However, many people are worried about the future partners of the former royal couple. Their fate will be as tragic as those experienced by Netflix and Spotify. Experts say Netflix's rejection of Megan is a sign of the Duchess's disgrace in the U.S. Her popularity is fading is what royal experts uttered after receiving shocking information from this online giant.
This isn't the only time Meghan Markle's prowess has come to light. There are many experts who have condemned the true competence of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex in the field of content production. Most of them think that the only thing that makes Harry and Meghan viable in Hollywood is the royal brand. The Duchess's upcoming podcast work has been questioned for its quality as it was created in such a short time. One royal expert offered the following advice. Harry and Meghan need to rethink how knowledgeable they are in the field of content production. In my experience, to produce a good piece of work and meaningful, it takes a producer months, even years, to conduct a project. In addition, the expert frankly commented that the new episode of Megan's podcast probably won't go through the quality moderation stage. I bet it only reaches third quality in terms of production content by Spotify. Weak capacity and unprofessional working attitude. Who will be the sponsor for Meghan Markle's animated project? Netflix made the mistake of choosing Harry and Meghan as fishing rods to attract television viewers. It has been two years since signing the cooperation contract. The former royal couple has not yet brought in any profit for this giant. Recently, the couple launched a long-delayed project that is Harry's documentary about the Invictus Games. It's unclear how much interest it will bring to Netflix, but it seems Prince Harry has angered Netflix bosses by doing a series of exclusive interviews with its rival. A source revealed that bosses screamed when confidential information about Harry's meeting with the Queen was revealed by the Prince himself to NBC. They believe that Prince Harry has betrayed them in a disgusting way, causing his and Meghan's trust to be reduced. However, it is strange that Netflix still wants to keep the value of the contract with Archwell Productions in the context of economic boiling water. Many sources revealed that Netflix is currently very interested in royal projects. Only the royal family will make their chaotic situation resolved. To access this new strategy... Harry and Meghan will become good prey for Netflix to give them a chance to approach the royal family. After all, this is the most reasonable answer for Netflix agreeing to maintain cooperation with Harry and Meghan in the context of the couple's limited capacity being revealed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are once again on the brink of betrayal. They have decided to return to the royal family to attend the Queen's Platinum Ceremony. This statement made the UK stand still. The Queen will continue to be sold out by her nephew's selfishness. Before Harry and Meghan's bold decision, recently... A royal source revealed that Buckingham Palace will tighten royal security to prevent the lens of the online giant in the U.S. In addition, the Queen has banned the Sussexes that they will not appear on the balcony of the palace with other senior members. Harry and Meghan suddenly became the most pitiable people on the planet when they were constantly rejected by their partners and family. However, after all they have done to the family, this is the only way for the royal family to protect themselves. 
Experts say Prince William planned to reconcile with Harry after a long time of tension, but the arrival of Netflix set him back. William expressed concern that the stories between him and Harry would be leaked out and become a money-making tool for Netflix. Therefore, William decided to temporarily put aside the reconciliation between the two brothers to focus on the 70th anniversary of the Queen's reign on the throne. What do you think of the new strategies of Meghan and online giant Netflix? Will the Duchess really succeed in finding a new destination for her Pearl project? And can Netflix use Harry to save the current crisis? Let us know your thoughts below in the comments section. See you in the next videos. See ya!